This is the first big new stent technology that's come across in the last several years. Uh, presently we have metallic stents that we implant and that's a permanent implant. Uh, this new stent technology allows us to deploy a new scaffold or stent uh, that gets absorbed by the body over the course of two to three years. Uh, that allows the artery to return to its normal state and return to normal motion. The traditional metallic stent is on the right. The new absorbable scaffold is on the left. You can see there are some differences between the two. The absorbable scaffold on the left has a more translucent appearance. It's more clear and it's a little bit thicker. The traditional metallic stent is on the right and it seems to be a little bit more streamlined. I'm going to show you an example of what these two stents look like deployed. I think the biggest benefit long term, um, yeah, yeah. there are some patients who receive multiple procedures and multiple stents. Um, and this allows for patients to have an implant that is absorbed over time uh, so that there is not a series of stents in place that may preclude future therapy. I would say that the two biggest benefits of the new uh, technology for this device that we're using here at the University of Kansas Hospital is that it has the medication coating on it uh, that's been shown to be beneficial with the metallic stents that are already out there. So it prevents some of that scar tissue buildup that we've always worried about with the metallic stents. In addition to that, the scaffold gets absorbed over the course of two to three years, which allows for that artery to return its normal motion uh, to contract and expand as it needs to.